Hi everyone, welcome to Melissa's Corner. I am Melissa, and uh, here at this channel we talk about a little bit of everything. I, some people say soup to nuts when it comes to bags, clothes, skincare, makeup, um, shoes, just about anything. Anything that I like, anything that I've kind of, um, my phase I'm going through, or things that I've purchased. These are all things that I've purchased myself. And it, otherwise, if it is not something I purchased myself, I will share with you if it's not something that I um, purchased. Uh, today, I have a coach haul to share with you. I'm not going to go over everything in detail. I'll go back and do some reviews in um, some future videos that will be coming up. But I just wanted to share with you what I bought. Well, the first thing I bought this past week, um, we were going to, we're, this is all from a road trip that we purchased on our way to visit my dad. Hadn't seen my dad in quite a while, about four years. Um, he was really sick about four years ago and then COVID hit. Um, and after that, we weren't able to go visit him because of the COVID and he can't get sick because um, it would just be detrimental to him. So we had to wait for um, safe timing to be able to go visit him. And the timing was now and we went to go and spend a couple of days with him in Squim, Washington. We got any people from Squim? Anybody from that side of the state? Well, it's beautiful. It is absolutely a gorgeous side of the state. And it was going to be quite a, quite a drive, quite a haul for us to get there. And not that we don't have vehicles that could get us there and would be just fine, but we thought it would be a good time to purchase a new car. So we went ahead and traded in one of our vehicles that we had, and we got this brand new, it's a 2023, and it's just like this beautiful candy apple red um, Camry, Toyota Camry, and she's just gorgeous we looked at some other cars you know there was like there's the lexus that's you know just a step up above of the toyotas but we both really love toyotas and we looked at that and then we looked at the camry and went back and looked at the lexus and went back and looked at the camry and for literally half the price it was everything we wanted and so we went ahead and purchased the Camry and she's just pretty and she has a sunroof and nice and smooth and just comfortable. Um, so that was her first adventure. So we took her to Squim and along the way the, we came across a town It's called North Bend, Washington, where they have outlet stores. And I'm like, honey, please, can we stop at the outlets on our way? And my husband's like, really? You need another handbag? I'm like, no, I don't need one, but can we stop and just look? So he's like, okay. And he was just as bad as me. Just as bad. He got in there and the boy did some shopping too. So between the two of us, we made a little dent into coach. And then we um, went shopping in some of the other stores there and I didn't like anything else that I saw. So I just walked away with coach stuff. Oh, and I did go to, if you've ever heard of Rocky Mountain Chocolate Factory, don't even hesitate. Just go in there and get the Avalanche Bar. It's like Rice Krispie Treat with chocolate chips in it and marshmallows and peanut butter and chocolate. Oh, oh, I'm just killing myself here just talking about it. Maybe I'll have a little bit of that later. But, but, I want to share with you the things I purchased. For one, I'll show you real quick. This was my bag for the weekend. And they actually had this one. This is a retail bag, but they had one at the outlet. Of course, I already have it, so I didn't get it. But I'll tell you, this is a great bag for a weekend trip. It, you know, it's a pack horse. It's awesome bag. So if you get a chance to go to an outlet, maybe ask them if they have that one perfect. So that was my bag of the day. And my fragrance of the day is John Paul, John Paul Gaultier. And it's the LaBelle. I love it. I love it. It's the lady in the bottle with the gold necklace. It's wonderful. But enough, enough. We're going to go through. I'm just going to show you the stuff I purchased. And like I said, we're going to go back and I'll do quick reviews on it in future videos so you can see. But right now, let's start with 
what my husband bought. He didn't even want to stop. He didn't even really want to look. But he came in and he got... He got sucked in. Yes, he did. He got sucked in and he did some damage of his own. So I'm going to share his stuff with you first. Let's see. He got a couple of small things in this big old bag I got here. Let's see. Oh, they had some great clearance stuff going on too. One of his things he got on clearance. He, first thing is he got this black, um, key ring holder and how many is there there's four four five key ring holder and then this snaps down and you can put another key or a fob hanging on there I thought that was pretty cool I liked it quite a lot and then you can tuck in your cards here over here it flips open and um yeah I just thought this was really cute. And of course, this could be for a man. It could be for a woman. Um, I, anybody could use this. He just wanted a plain black one. So he got this. And I'm like, yes, honey, do it, do it, do it. So he did. The next thing he found was this men's wallet. And this men's wallet, he loves to, you know, when you have to get your driver's license out all the time nowadays to show your identity. Um, but it has the card slots here. And then you flip this over, your identity goes here, your driver's license. You've got more card slots. And then you have your um, place to put your your currency bills and this actually split in two. So you can put receipts, whatever you want. But this was a great little thing. Um, and it's got these stripes that you can fill, fill in or in your pocket. Um, this was a great buy for him. He loves wallets. And so this is his new acquisition, the wallet the key fob but then on the clearance I'm like honey you know when we travel and stuff and if we're like only going somewhere overnight or we're on a plane you're always saying oh I need to get in my then the overhead to get his magazine or get his chewing gum for takeoff and um we found this this was on clearance it was 70 percent off and so I thought that was a super good deal here in the front, it has the um, jacquard fabric with the stripes in the black. This here is all leather. It's a nice, soft pebble grain. And look how thick that is. I mean, you can pack you can pack a bunch in this if you're going somewhere overnight and you just need to pack a few things. Nice, heavy leather straps that are, of course, adjustable. And then this um, it's kind of a, a mesh fabric that's added for comfort on your back so I thought this was a great buy for him he had never really thought about having one but I'm like well you know traveling through the airports or just like how we took off for a weekend to have things to be able to reach for this was um, a great purchase for him I was looking to see where the receipt is but I don't see it oh my goodness okay this says you know, their prices at the outlet are never true. I mean, come on, retail. But it's marked $544. So he got 70% off of that $544 for this. Um, which is about probably what it's worth. But it's a really, really nice backpack. So, you know, since he got a pack back, I'm like, hon, I need a backpack too. And he's like, so we went and we were looking in the women's backpacks. And um, I found this one that I really like. It again, it is all black and it's pebble leather. They had it in chalk, but um, I thought, you know, I don't want to get it. It'll probably wind up getting tossed around if I'm on an airplane or um, traveling. So I wanted it to be where it's not going to get all marked up. But it has this great small pocket, zip pocket here in the front. And it has two zips. So it really holds a lot too. And then it has that same mesh padded fabric on the back. And then it has these nylon straps, not the leather like his, but padded nylon. And this one's I got for, I think I got this one for $150. Um, was the price that it was marked down to. Let me see if it shows what it was 
you know, what they say is the original price there or what it would retail for. This one says comparable value at $4.98. So yeah, it's like a good 50% off or so, but it is just so cute. I'll show you guys more of this one later at another time. Um, but then I picked up one more bag. Um, oh, you know, I actually have another bag coming, but um, this one I picked up there. And I'd never seen this bag in person, so I wasn't sure. Look at this. It's in the chalk. And this is called the Lane. This is a Lane shoulder bag with the turn lock that just pops up here with this great little padded pocket. And then you've got the, the strap to where you can wear it um, over the shoulder. You can, it, it's a little, it's too short for me for crossbody, but um, pull them both up, make a nice little arm bag, shoulder bag, um, a longer shoulder bag that goes more down to your, to your hip but i thought this was just super cute and this the price on this one was um marked down to 190 is what this one was for and i'm going to see if the tag is in here what it was comparable value as they call it the comparable value says 450 so you know that's not a bad deal this is really a cute purse. My husband just loved it and it's nice and wide and has this back pocket. So I just wanted to come out, share with you guys the coach haul from this weekend. Oh, and I even found the receipt here. Let's see. I didn't know I had it. How much did we do a damage of? Our damage. Oh, and it says how much you save. They really try to make you feel good. We spent all together $709.00. But it says you saved $1,143. And that's them using that comparable price that they um, have on everything. So if you're looking for things at the outlet, um, that's a few that you're able to pick up or give them a call. Again, this is the one that was in North Bend, Washington that we went to. And um, it's a small store, but it was a mighty store. It had quite a few really awesome things in there. So that's all I wanted to share with you for today. But I do have um, another couple of handbags that I'm going to be bringing out. And I am going to do a little photo montage of our trip for the weekend to swim because it was so beautiful. It was so beautiful that I just have to share some of the the pictures and the scenery and the outlet mall with you so you could check it out. Um, so I will be doing that. And then I have um, another coach and I have a Rebecca Minkoff, which I, my very first Rebecca Minkoff. So I'm really excited about that. So today is Monday. I hope you guys are having a fabulous day. Keep your heads up, look up, not down. And I'll see you in my next video. Ta-ta. Bye.